My name is Julie Burke, and I am the Product Marketing Engineer for Texas Instruments Standard Linear and Logic Group. Thanks for joining me today as I tell you how LMV339 is creating more efficient designs. The portable consumer market is continually demanding smaller, lighter, more power efficient, and cost effective designs. TI's standard linear products are at the forefront in meeting this need with the creation of our newest quad comparator, LMV339. As a support to smaller designs, we dramatically reduced the size of the LMV339 from a large 4.5 by 5.1 TSOP package to a tiny 2x2 QFN package. This is 81% smaller than the previous package size, leaving considerable space and increasing your design capabilities. Being a quad comparator, the LMV339 contains four independent comparators. The output transistor of a comparator will conduct current to ground when the inverting input voltage is greater than the non-inverting input voltage. The output transistor blocks current flow when the non-inverting input voltage is greater than the inverting input voltage. This open collector output design allows outputs to be tied together as a wired AND gate. This circuit performs a window comparator function using two of the four comparator channels. The top comparator sets the common output signal low if the input signal is greater than the voltage at the upper threshold node, set by resistive divider. The bottom comparator sets the common output signal low if the input signal is less than the voltage at the lower threshold node, set by the other tap of the resistive divider. The LMV339 uses only 2.7 to 5.5 volts, making it a low voltage version of the quad comparator LM339, which operates from 5 to 30 volts. This device offers specifications that meet or exceed the familiar LM339 device at a fraction of the supply current. LMV339's new design has made it the most cost effective solution for applications where low voltage operation, low power, space saving, and price are the primary specifications in circuit design for portable consumer products, specifically cell phones, tablets, laptops, and MP3 players. Find out more about this part at ti.com slash LMV339 or engage in TI's E2E community, where you can ask questions and help solve problems just like these with fellow engineers. Just visit ti.com slash E2E. Thanks for watching.